Howdy everybody, thank you for tuning in and I hope you're all well today. So we're going to have a quick look at the Ostara or Optical Hardware 90 degree 1.25 inch prism diagonal. Notice I say prism and not a mirror. There is a prism in here very similar to what you get with a, with a spotting scope. And what does that do? Well with a, a standard 90 degree mirror diagonal the image will be the right way up when you this is for use with a, re, a refractor by the way or or or, or your max and your SCTs smith cassegrains what you'll notice with a, a mirror diagonal it'll be the right way up but the image will be left to right opposite and to some people that's a little bit tricky to use especially if using for terrestrial objects and others not it's just personal preference there is another way of getting correct orientation with a refractor and that is to use a 45 degree, this is a 90, a 45 degree diagonal but that makes looking up at the zenith a bit more, a bit more tricky, a bit more neck ache required to, to get those high angles. This particular one, it looks very very similar but not quite to the one that you get the, with the Celestron Power Seekers and the Celestron Astro Masters. I, I just had a look. They probably use the same prism inside, and these are quite low cost, so it will be a basic quality optically. This particular one, it has a plastic body, but it does feel very well constructed. You can just about see a thread on the inside, but it's not threaded for filters. So the the uh, if you want to use a moon filter, for example, or a light pollution filter, you will need to put it on the eyepiece. So, and also to keep the cost down, it just comes with a single grub screw there to tighten the eyepiece in. Works very nicely. It doesn't have a, a brass compression ring, but again, that is all to keep the cost down. So, advantages of using a 90 degree, 90 degree, <coughs> excuse me, prism diagonal. You're going to get correct orientation, which is very useful in particular if you're using on terrestrial subjects. There uh, may be the one disadvantage, and by all means let me know in the comments below if you've found anything. With it being a prism, rather than a mirror, you might notice a bit more chromatic aberration or false colour. For example, if you're looking at the moon, you might notice a little bit more of a blue or purple coloured uh, fringing around the edges of it that you might not see with a, a mirror. The differences were quite small, but... But, uh, but they may be there. So with this prism you get, with this diagonal sorry, you get a basic white box and I, I also, I always make a note of packing that very well with that extra paper whatever when I'm posting it. And you do get the lens caps for either side to keep the dust off it when not in use. So there we are, that's a quick look at the Ostara or Optical Hardware, all from the same company. 90, 90 degree prism diagonal, I got that right. 1.25 inch this one, available to purchase in the link below. So as always, I hope this helps. Thank you very much for watching and we shall see you next time.